I was listening to a leader describe the strategic vision for their organization and its members recently. As he spoke, I realized I was being treated with the most elusive form of strategy. It's the one that every leader wants, but very few get. I'll tell you what it is today on Crystal Clear Management. Welcome to the channel. I'm Crystal Lee, a principal consultant with Oliver White, coaching global leaders to achieve business excellence. I've created this channel to share with you what we're seeing right now, the good and the bad, to help you win big and avoid disastrous mistakes. After looking under the hood of your organization, if an outsider was to write down what they thought the vision, mission, and strategy of your company was, would they get it right? Do your actions, decisions, and results as a company reveal what you value most and what you exist to deliver? When we work with companies to improve their operational performance, we always start by looking at what they are trying to achieve, their strategy. However, I'm often surprised by what's documented as their strategy. It's usually quite good, but rarely reflects the priorities and direction being executed in the day-to-day -day operations of the business. Oftentimes, there's not a strong link between what they say they wanna do and what their organization and processes are actually delivering. However, once in a while, something different happens. Once in a while, I get to witness the most elusive type of strategy, one that is actually being operationalized every day, one that guides decision-making, priorities, investments, and performance measures, and one that is so clear even an outsider can see its mark on the day-to-day -day management of the business. The pursuit of this type of alignment to strategy is at the heart of integrated business planning. It's what makes IBP so effective and so different from other processes that only seek to balance supply and demand. When you reflect on the choices, focus areas, investment decisions, and performance results of your organization, there should be obvious alignment between what you want to do and what you are actually doing. This level of alignment is hard to come by without IBP, but how else can you expect to achieve your ambitions as an organization? Was that helpful? Give me a like, hit subscribe so that you get notified as I share proven tips to help you transform your business, achieve mind-blowing financial results, and dramatically improve the lives of your employees. If you'd like to chat about how I can help you personally achieve business excellence, my contact information is down below. This type of transformational leadership is not for the faint of heart, but if you have the guts, I can get you there. See you soon.